Hey gang, um, my name is Chelsea. I am live from my horse barn and if you can see in my sunglasses, I hung my phone by the pop socket on our fans that are rigged up in hay nets. So I have supervisors, that's Buddy and Tucker. Um, and I'm gonna get to it because I can talk for hours if I'm allowed to. So my name is Chelsea, I am 25 and I work at a specialty and referral based vet clinic. Um, I work the front desk, but I also dabble in inventory. So my work days are busy, chaos, etc. Um, but I wanted to give the challenge a try. Um, I tried previous challenges and just after about a week, I was like, mm, not gonna work, gave up, way too easy. Um, I just think the self-discipline wasn't there. Um, so my goal for this challenge was simply to just do it. Don't back out, stick to your guns, 30 days, do it, do it well. Um, I noticed in April that my jeans were starting to get uncomfortable to sit in, um, which was kind of a red flag for me. Um, so that was, this challenge was the push and start I needed to make those jeans fit better. Um, and that was kind of the second goal I had, but like I said, completion was my main goal. Um, so I didn't see a lot of change on the scale, which naturally pretty discouraging. Um, I started, excuse the birds, I'm sorry. Um, I started at about 208, ended at about 205 for weight, which is fine. Um, my measurements showed a lot better. Um, I was down like an inch and a half in my chest. Um, my arms were almost an inch, it was like three quarters of an inch. Um, three inches on my waist, which I was kind of surprised by. Um, and then like my thighs got an inch lost, I, inch, I lost an inch on my thighs, sorry, um, and my calves. So that was kind of exciting. I didn't really think about it until about two weeks in. I was like, hmm, those jeans I was talking about got a little looser and I could sit on them for like an hour or two and not be uncomfortable. So I was so excited. Um, I noticed a self-confidence boost. I normally wouldn't be able to talk to my phone and then post it on the internet. So that's cool. Um, and then, like I said, my jeans are more comfortable. Um, it was tough to get a schedule down or routine down due to my schedule, um, but I utilize Google Calendar to plan my days. So I'll put a screenshot of that over my face um, so you can see. Um, I learned it's doable and time management is everything. I was reading while I was on the treadmill or on the bike to kind of double up and get things done. I journaled and I meditated in my car on my lunch break a lot of times. Um, and even when I didn't want to do it, I did it because I wanted to be a little more self-disciplined. Um, many mornings before I went to work, I was reading on the bicycle in the living room in my pajamas. So um, yeah, big thank you to Fallon and Alex for putting it together. Um, the challenge was doable, manageable, and realistic. And I think it gave me a great foundation to keep it up and keep going. So thank you. Um, and again, thank you.